two minutes, D'Amico, two. Everything continues to look good. We'll have about three and a half minutes from the time the Centaur cuts off until Mars Science Laboratory separates from the Centaur upper stage. At that time, it'll be at an altitude of 105 nautical miles. It'll operate smoothly at 100% thrust. Coming up on one minute to make go two. This is the control room in the Atlas Space Flight Operations Center where engineers are intently watching the no. data come back from the rocket. We have cut off. We have Miko 2. Shutdown signature looks good. Four S engines are on. And we, re we are beginning to reorient to our separation attitude. Fuel tank is venting down. We do have a uh, video from Diego Garcia. Body rates are smoothing out as we approach that attitude. This is a uh, live camera from the Centaur stage looking at the spacecraft for spacecraft separation coming through the Diego Garcia tracking station in the Indian Ocean. 50% settling as expected. Body rates are nice and smooth. We're about two minutes now from spacecraft separation. Everything looking good, getting ready for spacecraft. Up. Once again, this is a live camera on the Centaur, looking toward the spacecraft. Approximately 10 seconds. Body rates look good. And we pass tumble check. We started settling. And we've begun spin up for spacecraft separation. One minute, one minute to spacecraft separation. Expecting 15 degrees per second and roll. It's 
spin-up continues nominally, everything looking good. Thirty seconds to say scratch up. Spin up continues. Five seconds, spacecraft set. Achieved our targeted roll rate. We have spacecraft separation. And confirmation from our video system. And the vehicle has been spun. And with the successful separation of the MSL spacecraft from AB28, this concludes the commentary for this mission.